it is my mission, now that I've actually jumped in with both feet, bought my skateboard, is to ollie before my 40th birthday. I'm very hopeful. I'm having so much fun. And that's kind of the bottom line here, right? When you're trying something new, as long as you're having fun and you're enjoying doing it, that's the whole point. So uh, we're gonna put a close to here on day one and uh, we'll see you again when we, sh when we give it a few more tries. Okay, well, we skipped a day of practice because I was sore the next day. My knee was sore, my back was sore. You kind of don't realize what kind of muscles that you use when you uh, try to do tricks on a skateboard. But yeah, it was it was rough. So I took yesterday off. We're gonna try again today. So here I am, I'm out in public, not on just my street near my house. But uh, now I'm just gonna let it fly, see if we can find a good spot here that's level and uh, get this board off the ground. So we took a fall, but what do we do when we fall, right? I think that's the lesson here is this isn't gonna happen for me in one day or in one week, but when I fall, I get back up. That was a bad fall too, by the way. <laughs> but we, we get back on the board and we try again. So that's all for me today. I feel like the fall, uh, I gave it a few more tries after the fall, but uh, after that, I felt like my body was like telling me, don't try again until, until you're not so butt hurt. <laughs> Three days later. So the sun's about to set and we're gonna try, get out here and try. This is only the like, second time I've tried this week. And um, it's a nice day. I haven't been out either because my allergies have been bothering me. Yay, California, at least Northern California. So uh, we're gonna try and get this done today. We've only got like five minutes left of sunlight. <laughs> so we're gonna give it a, like 10 more tries and then we're gonna go back inside. The sun is pretty much set. Gonna give it a rest for today. I don't think I got any closer today, which is kind of frustrating. But like I said, uh, I've only been at this for about a week. Actually, yeah, I got my board about a week ago today. So if we've been at it a week and we're probably about the same place we were when we started, but we are trying. So we'll be back at it again probably tomorrow. All right, say goodbye to the sun. Bye sun. The next day. So we hit a little bump in the road today. Uh, I went to ride my skateboard, which I try to do every day, and went out for just a ride around the block, basically, and uh, got a huge cramp in my calf. It hurts to walk, it hurts to flex my calf, so I don't know how long this is gonna keep me away from riding and uh, attempting uh, to do my ollie, but hopefully it's not more than a day or two. It's just one of those things where, right, when you want to do something, when you have goals, you're going to hit bumps in the road, you're going to hit obstacles. And it's how you handle that 
and making sure that you bounce back and instead of giving up because you meet these obstacles or, or these stumbling blocks is just a big part of, of life and of, of getting through challenges and, and, and goals that you want to reach. So anyway, just thought I'd take a minute to, uh, to talk because it just happened and it really sucks. We'll bounce back. Four to six weeks later. So what I was kind of worried about might happen has happened and life got in the way of giving this a consistent go every you know every few days or you know even on the weekends long story short what happened was uh you know we get real i got real involved with my production and then on the weekends i'm doing shows and during the day i'm trying to take care of, take care of other business and then before you know it we're like three weeks away from my birthday and we've got to get this done so we're out here today it's been like a month since i gave it a good uh proper go so we're gonna give it a go today and we'll see the kind of results we get. I'm not expecting too much. And actually, you know what? Let me recap. I actually did a couple ollies because all four wheels left the ground and I landed them. Um, but I wanna do a proper ollie. I wanna get all four wheels off. I want my feet to still be on the board and I wanna catch more than just like like that much air with, with all four wheels. So um, like I said, we're gonna give it a proper go right now and we'll see what we get. So the time has come and passed for trying to accomplish an ollie before my 40th birthday. And in a way, I did ollie before my 40th birthday. You know, I'll, I'll put the video up here so you can see the, <laughs> the slow motion of, <laughs> because that's the only way you're gonna see the, all four wheels getting off the ground. At the time, I didn't even know that I had done it, but I did do it. So mission accomplished, I guess. It was a little anticlimactic because like I said, I didn't even know that I'd done it at the time. Uh, and I just wanted it to be, you know, I wanted to be, I wanted it to be all four wheels higher off the ground. I wanted my feet to stay on the board, but never having tried to do an ollie before and only riding a skateboard when I was, when I was younger. And you know, one time as an adult, uh, I'm happy with, with the results. Um, I guess the big takeaways here are that I tried something new and I set out to do something, I did it. Uh, I will keep at it though. Don't think that this is the end of my skateboarding adventure because I'm gonna keep riding. You know, I've got my board now, it's mine, and I will ride the crap out of this thing. And this is just gonna be something that's part of my life now. And it, that's exciting to me, it, it's fun. Um, it's something that I can do with my kids because now my kids want, want to ride too. And it's just, that part of it has been really satisfying. I wish there was uh, a more triumphant ending to this adventure, but like I said, the big takeaway here is that I did try. I hope it wasn't disappointing for all of you who tuned in to watch these videos. We're hoping to see me really get like this sick Ollie, you know, with major air. <laughs> yeah, I'm old. <laughs> But like I said, what I hope you take away with this, along with what I've taken away from this, is get out there and try something new. And just, you know, if there's something maybe that you wanted to do as a, as a kid or as a teen, or maybe before you had kids, or just something that's completely out of your comfort zone, uh, just do it. You know, there's no, no harm in trying, and especially uh, you can come away with a new experience and hopefully, like what I've done with skateboarding, um, you come away with something that is fun and something that you can do uh, for a long time. All right, guys, that is all I've got for you today. I appreciate you watching. If you like this video, make sure you hit that thumbs up down there, which is the like button. And if you haven't already, smash that subscribe button.
If you're out there riding, whether it be on your motorcycle or your skateboard, be safe. And if you're not riding, get riding. I'm that one guy, and I am out.